question was, do our zombies run? And we said no. Our zombies do not run. They do not run. Because running, according to Simon Pegg, <laughs> takes the psychological danger of the zombie and our inability to avoid them and transforms them into an immediate danger, which is far less interesting mm. than the character development that you get from the psychological of people not being able to avoid zombies on their own. So there, therefore our zombies are the traditional George, shambling, George Romero zombies. walking, Original George maybe Romero a little zombies. bit flaily compared to the George Romero zombies, we, but we have we're on some, stage. We so. do have some flailing... Uh, not a lot. They more, stagger a little bit more than you, they shamble. Yeah. You kind of need fail, uh, flailing when you're in a smaller setting like that. Because Even the the, fl the flailing fills up more space. Well, yeah. theatrical so, zombies. Yeah. Well, theatrical yeah. means bigger. The right. important thing is for the audience to be less. able to audience needs to be able kind to tell the out. difference between the zombies and the humans. And some of that, as our venue increases, it's a good thing we built that yeah, in because hear? now in a larger space, um, we need the zombies to be able to really act different from the humans mm -hmm. um, in such a way that the audience, even if they can't make out the makeup effects mm -hmm. as, as distinctly, will be able to say, that's a zombie, that's yeah. a human. Because makeup changes in mid-stage are kind of hard to do, so it's better if someone can portray, uh, uh, I'm not a zombie. And it has worked. We do it, I think, at least twice. Particularly when somebody dies and then reanimates, mm -hmm. which sometimes can happen. And it's predictable.